Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says if A is equal to the matrix with elements cos alpha, minus sin alpha, sin alpha, cos alpha, then for what value of alpha is A an identity matrix? Before moving on to the solution, we will discuss what an identity matrix is. Consider A square matrix A equal to Aij which is an n by n order matrix. So this A is an identity matrix if we have the elements of the square matrix A given by Aij would be 1 where i is equal to j, that is, the diagonal elements are 1 and rest of the elements are 0. So when this condition is satisfied, then we say that the square matrix A is an identity matrix, that is, a square matrix in which all the elements in the diagonal are 1 and rest of the elements are 0. And we denote the identity matrix by i. Since the square matrix A is an identity matrix, so A is equal to i. This is the key idea that we use for this question. Let's now proceed with the solution. We are given a square matrix A with elements cos alpha minus sin alpha in the first row, sin alpha, cos alpha in the second row. And we are supposed to find the value of alpha such that the square matrix A is an identity matrix. Now, the square matrix A is an identity matrix. So this would mean that the matrix with elements cos alpha minus sin alpha in the first row, sin alpha, cos alpha in the second row is equal to the matrix of order 2 by 2 with the diagonal elements as 1 and the rest of the elements as 0. Now, equating the elements of these two matrices, we have cos alpha would be equal to 1. Then, the sin alpha would be equal to 0. Cos alpha equal to 1 gives us alpha equal to 0. And also, sin alpha equal to 0 gives us alpha equal to 0. Therefore, we have the value of alpha as 0, which is our final answer. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.